and welcome to Fortis Live Television. Today we are privileged to be in the blessed company of an educator. As a matter of fact, he is the principal of Dabro Christian Community College, one of the biggest secondary schools in London. So, my dear, impression of Reverend Dr. Nicodemus D.K. Mohammed Solomon. And he is the principal also. A pleasant good afternoon, very and welcome to Fortis Live. Yeah, how you doing? And God bless you for mm. coming here. Okay. And we appreciate you. Okay. So, we are in the new academic. How is everything going? Well, um, it's well. It's, it's getting better. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, we have been in the sector for some time. And so, uh, we deal with the matter, uh, you know, mm -hmm. as we already have our calendar. Mm -hmm. We uh, have our them. Uh, everything in place and uh, things are moving fine. So how is that? Is this you are? I want to believe you completed the first period already. Yeah, first period have been completed. Mm -hmm. uh, graces are up, mm -hmm. and uh, we have done some the praises. Mm -hmm. Those that did well, we have given them some prizes, mm -hmm. and those that uh, didn't perform well, mm -hmm. we also give them some prizes by punishing them. Mm -hmm. You know, doing some not corporate punishment, mm -hmm. but the old punishment that will make you to remember that uh, you have to study. Because the country depends on you, you know. <clears throat> you know, I have been a principal for um, a number of years, mm -hmm. and representing the Republic of Liberia on the Council of Wyatt, West African as mm -hmm. uh, between uh, the rest of the English-speaking West African country, mm -hmm. uh, and never in the history, <coughs> excuse me, of this country, that um, a president have come here to decide. To pay the fee or why yeah, I'm not talking about small small scholarship, mm -hmm. a small small assistant, mm -hmm. but where you come and pay the entire country. I've been I had to be reminded, I had to be corrected, and uh, I stand uh, to receive that. Mm -hmm. So I think uh, George Weir, the President, His Excellencies, uh, have been the first uh, to do such uh, uh, in my living memory. Eighteen doing so much. Oh, not that he's doing so much, but he has started something good. Okay, now look, let me take you back on the, the education for the senior high student. Recently, the Ministry of Education came up with a program according to them, they will provide a free tutorial for 12 weeks. Uh, students, are you, are, you, are you going to work with them? Are you, your institution also part of that program? Yeah, in the first place, uh, I think uh, the Liberian government uh, need to be commended, you know, our, our Minister Sony uh, is one of our own, uh, Dr. Mm -hmm. Sony, uh, among us. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm talking about from the uh, uh, old um, school, and I think he understand the, the, the dynamic mm -hmm. of, of education and how to build up the system. Mm -hmm. And so, and the George we are the Excellences, is also close with our system. Mm -hmm. And so, with every one of them come putting together, Joy Howard Taylor, and the rights of our excellences are uh, coming together in government. So I think uh, I think uh, there will be something coming up. You 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 believe that much much will be done on its administration? In my mind, in my mind, yeah. In my mind. Okay. Then look at recently the president also announced uh, all public university free to librarians. When you heard that information, how did you feel like as an educator? Uh, you, you know, when you talk about um, affecting, the touching the life, the, 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 the general life of people, you know, uh, that's what we are talking about. Mm -hmm. That directly, directly, not indirectly, but directly touching the mind, the life mm -hmm. of the children or of the parents or of the Liberian people. Uh, if you tell somebody that, Oh, I will build. I will build. It, I will build that. Yes, fine, beautiful. But mm -hmm. it, it may not be effort in my life. Mm -hmm. But you are paying my tuition directly. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get my education directly. Mm -hmm. So that for myself, if I let, I mess it up. I let, I make good use of it. So in that level, I be having children. Mm -hmm. I to go to school, and the six years that have been assigned to President Weir, uh, they can use that on the canopy to receive their first degree. It disturbing, mm -hmm. um, very much disturbing. That was the first day that I went to bed and I could not take a sleep mm -hmm. until I told my wife to prepare me 
yeah, uh, a cup of over tea mm. so that I can get to sleep because uh, it's so trendy and so disturbing. You know, when such a huge percentage mm. are taking drugs, then I think, uh, I believe, that uh, claims uh, the president we are uh, in his government and the Liberian people attention. Mm. And uh, even I, my parents said my attention mm. is also claims and church leaders and Muslim leaders, who you are, you have a religion, you know, you know mark your woman, and that's your clear intention. And make sure that we prioritize the eradication and the minimization mm. of uh, the sale of drugs on our market. We're not destroying the fabric of our future. Mm -hmm. Anything is interesting. So finally, Reverend Bobby, let me ask you this question before I take leave of you. We are back on your campus. What are some of those awesome curricular activities you offered here for your students? Well, we, we, we have a lot of things. Uh, we trying to uh, have a, uh, a little home economic group of uh, 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 department trying to add it up. Mm -hmm. I trying to get some uh, uh, even agriculture, but you know, even though it's just coming up, but uh, uh, that's what we do, and we have a lot of playing. But uh, I, I, in my mind, uh, uh, it all goes well. By next year, there will be other activities added uh, on the water we personally do. Okay, what do you personally do? Okay, Reverend, finally, before I take leave for you, maybe there's some burning issues you want to speak on and I did not ask. Yes, I, I wonder, I don't know what, um, uh, um, you know, the, the, the public institution, I uh, was speaking the other day, mm -hmm. uh, looking at some of the universities and uh, colleges and uh, what have you, I think that uh, with the pronouncement that have been made by the Liberian government through the uh, hey excellences, mm -hmm. and it is now time that uh, mechanism be put into place that whatsoever minimum amount, whether it is uh, registration, whether it is activity, what kind of fee, that the president of Liberia, President Weir, uh, appoint a particular group of educators that will help the board or the favorite community colleges and even not the university. So I should see how much being collected. Mm -hmm. For example, uh, let me just uh, let the cat out of bed. If you look at the University of Liberia, mm -hmm. they administer entry over entrance mm -hmm. year in year out. And if you gave two thousand five hundred or less or more, you can calculate. You 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 know the book. Mm -hmm. uh, and you get about thirty thousand present, or gave ten thousand, fifteen thousand present entry. You can just see the amounts of money that have been collected. That have been collected. So uh, where the money go? Well, somebody will say, hey, you don't got no right to question where the money go. But the money come from our children. The money come from Liberian people pocket. So this is why, as an educator myself, I'm asking where the money go. Because we need to know where the money go. So that's why I'm asking President we are to establish an independent body to join with the board of the university. Mm -hmm. So I, he can cut that from the Federal High School, and if President, we are going to use um, the Reverend Dr. Solomon, Nicodemus Solomon, I'm sitting here, he can have me invited, and the university and myself can work together and make sure that money collected are used for the intended. If you let purple, purple say what you want to use is up to you, mm -hmm. but you can collect millions of data. And they become a uh, messy linear, they become operational. Operational, I don't know why you, what kind of operation you have. Mm -hmm. Operation to buy the, um, a computer, operation mm -hmm. to buy what, to buy cartridge, operation to go to America and come back tomorrow morning, operation to do what? That should be clearly defined. And, and, and President Weir can go from county to county where they have the community colleges. And the point, so you yes, uh, uh, a kind of financial committee that going to work with the university and colleges because the government is subsidizing the institution. So they are definitely the government institution. So whatever money that uh, will be collected by these uh, uh, colleges or universities should be used for development of the college or the university. 
And that will not be done on the president we have. Can appoint other people that will work with the whatever board they may have, a system board that, will, that they may have constitutionally. And he being the president, he got that right. And so um, look look at that take LU for example. Uh, you got the old buses uh, to, to what they call Quebec garage, or how you call it, red leg garage. Mm -hmm. The old, old buses breaking down all over the place and parking all the garage and collect them and put children inside, carry them, break down, and walk them around and go all over. Now, the money that I collected, the, the entrance, where the money go? Why you can't go to China or go to Dubai or go to America, wherever you want to go, and get the bus and put on the road? I think that can be done. I stand to be corrected. Uh, so I think, uh, President, we uh, need to go another step. Not only by waving or by trying the new government to pay tuition, but he should go one more step. Then I come to the high school. The high school, yeah, they are doing their best. They collect um, a table they feed and blah, 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 blah. But where did their money go? Sometimes I should get in the school, say, oh, government never sent me a coffee machine. Government did not send the other machine. Government also another machine. But you collecting registration fee, you are collecting activity fee, then where the money go? So, President, we are again, need to tell my own friend and brother, Dr. Sony, to appoint and the got county board, the got education board, mm -hmm. and county, I know that. I'm talking about community. If the school is in the community, I believe they got parent and they got parent teacher association, PTA, mm -hmm. and then by a particular body, government can empower them. That you, PTA, you may show sure work with the principal to know where the money go. And if the principal is a damn, he should be a, he should be held accountable and give a kind. They like to put money. Mm -hmm. you know, I'm very sorry. Maybe I don't I know I've had a lot of problem, a lot of call will come on my telephone, but I know they're gonna beat me all over the place, but never mind. Mm -hmm. That's my personal feeling. Okay. And God bless you. Thank you very much, Reverend. Well, nice having you. Thank you.